Hey there, viewers! There are few things more terrifying than finding a disgusting rodent in your house. The easiest way to get rid of these unwanted visitors is to buy commercial pesticide from the supermarket. But these pesticides may contain harmful chemicals which are very toxic and dangerous for humans. This is why in today's video, we will tell you about the best ways to get rid of pests and rodents using organic, non-toxic, and completely natural options. What are these different natural remedies? Are they better than commercial products? Stay tuned to find out more! Number 1. Citrus for Spiders If you jump at the sight of spiders, we have something for you. Spiders are not very fond of citrus. In a spray bottle, mix water and unsweetened lemon or lime juice. Then thoroughly wipe your countertops and infested areas with this concoction. You can also spray this mixture down on your doorways and windowsills as a precautionary measure. If you have spiders in your garden and you spread lemon, orange, or lime peels, you will never see those spiders again. Number 2. Homemade Flypaper for Flies Flypaper is an excellent way to capture and kill those bothersome flies. Although there are many commercially prepared solutions available, you can easily prepare your own using common ingredients in your home at a fraction of the cost. Just heat up a combination of honey, sugar, and water on the stove, and dip in some paper strips cut out of a grocery bag. After the paper is coated, hang the strips up over the stove to dry, then hang these strips around the house. After a few days, you will have a disgusting yet admirable insect collection to toss in the trash. Number 3. Garlic Spray for Insects you may know garlic for its pungent aroma and health benefits, but did you know that it's the strong scent that comes into play when used as a natural insecticide? To make a basic garlic spray, take two bulbs of garlic and put them in a blender with a small amount of water. Let the mixture sit overnight, then strain it into a jar, adding a half a cup of vegetable oil, one teaspoon of mild liquid soap, and enough water to fill the jar. To use this homemade insecticide, use one cup of mixture with one quart of water and spray liberally in infested areas. You can use this both indoors and outdoors in your garden and on plants as well. Number 4. Essential Oils for Bed Bugs Bed bugs can give anyone sleepless nights, quite literally. Essential oils like tea tree oil, eucalyptus, lemongrass, and lavender are very effective against these pesky creatures. These oils can both kill as well as repel bed bugs. It is very easy to use. Add 6 to 10 drops of any of the pure essential oils to a spray or an atomizer filled with spring or distilled water. You can either add all of the essential oils alone or all together, depending on how the scent strikes you. Then spray around the affected areas and see those creepy crawlies die. Number 5. Ground Coffee for Ants Ants do not love coffee the way you do. In fact, they hate it. The smell of the coffee repels ants. You can sprinkle ground coffee around plants or mix them into the soil as you plant your garden. There isn't a perfect formula for how much coffee grounds to use, so you may need to try different quantities to determine just how much works in your garden. Don't put out more than a quarter cup of grounds in one spot as it may develop mold. If you have ants around your house, sprinkle coffee in areas where you think these ants might be emerging. Number 6. Diatomaceous Earth for Cockroaches Diatomaceous earth is a naturally occurring soft, sedimentary rock that can be easily crumbled into a fine white powder. It is a great natural roach killer and is harmless to people. You can sprinkle in areas where roaches gather, especially in hidden parts, such as cabinet tops and behind appliances. The tiny particles cut the waxy exoskeleton of roaches and kills them within 48 hours. For a week or so after the treatment, the dehydrating insects will search more actively for water. So do not be surprised if you see roaches more often after the treatment. Most roaches should be killed within two weeks of application. It is easily available at your local supermarket as well as online. Number 7. Thai Lemongrass as Mosquito Repellent Sympopicon citratus also known as Thai lemongrass, is a natural and effective mosquito repellent. It contains the natural oil citronella, which is safe and effective for use. In fact, lemongrass citronella is considered more effective than true citronella as an insect repellent. You can buy Thai lemongrass at garden centers and supermarkets. It grows readily into a clump, about 15 inches across and about 2 feet tall. To use as a mosquito repellent, break a stalk off from the clump and peel off the outer leaves until you find a scallion-like stem at the base. Bend the stem between your fingers, loosening it, then rub it vigorously between your palms. It will soon become a pulpy, juicy mass. Rub this all over exposed skin at least once. 
You can also make a tincture using alcohol for spray applications. Planting Thai lemongrass around your garden and patio will also help repel mosquitoes. Number 8. DIY Tea Light Trap for Fleas Fleas can be quite a problem, especially if you have pets. Managing them can be quite a challenge and an expensive affair as well. This DIY flea trap is inexpensive and easy to make. Fill a couple bowls with water and mix two tablespoons of dish soap into each one. After mixing the soap into the water, carefully place a single battery-operated tea light candle into each one. Then place it in areas where you are having the highest concentration of fleas. You can repeat this process for a number of other traps and place them in key areas. The best time to place these traps is at night, right before you go to bed. Once the lights are out, the fleas will be drawn to the trap. Ideally, this will be the last thing they ever see. Number 9. Soap sprays for beetles and white flies. Soap spray is very similar to the previously mentioned essential oil homemade spray. The difference is that this spray can be used to effectively control mites, aphids, white flies, beetles, and other hungry little critters. To make a basic soap spray insecticide, mix one and a half teaspoons of a mild liquid soap with one quart of water and spray the mixture directly on the infected surfaces. Just remember to apply it in the evenings or early mornings for best results. Number 10. Vinegar for moths and slugs Apart from adding flavor to your food, vinegar is quite effective in driving those moths and slugs away. Just combine three parts water with one part vinegar and spray on the infected areas. You can use either white or apple vinegar to your mixture. Be careful when applying the solution to certain plants. The acidic nature of the vinegar can damage some of the delicate foliage. Always test it on a small area first before applying it in large amounts. Number 11. Instant Mashed Potatoes for Mice This might sound a little weird, but it is a really good and cheap way to get rid of mice. Simply sprinkle a few tablespoons around the area where the mice frequent. When the mice will eat the potatoes, the flakes will expand in their stomachs and kill them even before they're fully digested. Just to be safe, make sure that the flakes are out of reach from any pets. The last thing you want are the animals that are welcome in the house to be affected. Number 12. Orange Oil for Termites this is an effective and natural way to instantly get rid of termites. The oil is derived from orange peels, and you can buy it from home improvement or garden stores, as well as online. Orange oil is made mostly of D-lemonine, which is deadly to termites. It causes the exoskeleton of termites to dissolve, which results in them losing moisture and protein. You can spray the oil directly onto termites or on areas where you suspect termites to be. You can also spray the oil to deter termites from coming into the area. Number 13. Apple Cider Vinegar for Fruit Flies Apple cider vinegar has a strong, sweet odor which is very attractive to fruit flies. Using this property, you can make your very own fruit fly death trap which is safe, effective, and cheap. Just pour apple cider vinegar into an open cup or bowl and add a drop or two of dish detergent into it. Place it near your fruit bowl or trash can. The fruit flies will become attracted to the smell of the vinegar. Upon touching the bowl, the dish detergent makes these flies immediately sink and drown. Within a day, you will have nipped the problem in the bud. Have you ever tried any of these non-toxic natural remedies? How did that work out for you? Let us know in the comments section below. Enjoyed this video? Hit like, share, and subscribe to Bestie. Wait, what kind of bestie would we be if we don't tell you about our other awesome videos? Go ahead, choose the left or right video and enjoy.